What's up guys, Nepenthes here and welcome back to another episode of The Road to Glory. Guys, EA have returned the Lib and Sud League SBCs. However, if they weren't already bad, they have nerfed them to the nth degree, man. They have, look, when they came out the first time, they had Jumbo Premium Gold Players Pack and a small rare gold players pack as a reward. But for the Libertadores, you also got an 86 plus rated player pack. And for the Sudamericana, you got a 383 plus rated player pack. So even though every, most things are untradeable, it was still like, hey, as a trade-off, this is still okay. Um, we're going to complete the Sudamericana. I just kind of want to have a little look at what's going on. We've done the first six segments with items I had in the club, along with the final as well. So I've got five segments to go, but now I need silver Sudamericana cards. Um, so what I thought I'd do is before we finish that off, let's open the packs that we picked up. Um, mostly silver packs. Now, of course, the beautiful thing is, is silvers are general, uh, general, generally fairly, um, expensive. You know, they can be, they can be quite, uh, quite good. And in fact, getting that one guy right there, um, and this guy as well, you doll, he could be, uh, <laughs> you doll, uh, he could be worth a little bit, but yeah. Monsalvo, not worth all that much right now. Um, yeah, even 600, 500 coins, but we're going to keep him because we're going to use him. And uh, we'll see if we get any other good things in there. So the Spanish dance celebration, let's uh, list that one up. Um, what about this badge here? Oh, no, that's a stadium theme, beg your pardon. We can get rid of all of that. And we can get rid of those two as well. And uh, we've got one uh, other gold pack at the end. Now, of course, the silver packs are tradable. So that's where you're going to have to try your best to get your money back out of this. The gold packs are untradeable, which obviously allows you to continue to grind other untradeable um, packs outside of it. That guy's, yeah. When other league SBCs come out as well, it'll be even better because you'll be able to sell the other cards. But I'm concerned that the whole point of EA putting a timer on things is that you won't have the ability to continually make profit through selling the bronze and silvers um, and instead, the idea is that the you know these league SBCs will be here for a cut for a month. Maybe in two weeks' time, another set come out. Then two weeks later, these ones go, and another set come out. And again, keep it on some rotation system to try and keep people from profiting, basically. Which, as we all know, would be typical from EA, but would just be absolutely awful. It's, it's just it's just not great. Um, so, I don't know, like, I knew, I had a feeling they were going to nerf League SBCs this year, because I think people, it was just so easy to make money, um, to make, uh, wait, the 96 badge is 5k? All right, I'll go and have a look at that in a second. Um, yeah, it's just so easy to make coins off of League SBC and things like that. Um, come on, can we get some uh, Lib or Sud cards here, please? I really, I'm going to need them. Um, but, uh, yeah, it's, it's just, it's just typical EA, isn't it, of, just once again, going out of their way to make people's experience who grind this game and people that spend the most time on this game less fun, which is really sad from their behalf. Right, we get one uh, Libertadores card. That's decent-ish, I suppose. Tavernier can go up on into the trade pile. Uh, I've got one Prime Electron Players pack here as well. It is untradeable. Obviously, if I pack something nice, that would be very, very good. Whether or not I'm going to, that is another uh, another thing entirely. There's another uh, Libertadores card there, which is quite nice. So Prime Election Players Pack, then I'm going to go and buy the cards to finish this off for, for today's video. Um, we don't get boards, or we might have boards in here. It's going to be a Libertadores card. So we'll also be able to use that for the Libertadores grind. Um, let's see what else is in here. Ooh, I mean, an 85 is not bad. It'll help with uh, grinding other SBCs. And that's why I think it's, it, you know, you could argue that it's not going to be terrible. Um, but yeah, let's go and finish these off, guys. And I will be right back. If the time limit wasn't there, do you think it would still be viable or not? I mean, listen, the, people will find a way to make this value. It's just that in terms of making coins, EA have ruined it, right? Really good challenge. Oh, I'd won that ball. Did win that ball. No. Yes. Yes. All right. That ball was not the. That was not the angle I played it. I'll take the goal with Dembele there. But yeah, that really wasn't the angle I played that one at.
Oh, I've read that. No, I've read that game. I've read that. That's so sad. I've read that so well. Oh, that's the goal. Ah, he's actually got there. Go on. Let's go. Do you know what I, I did as well? Earlier on in the game, right, I had the ball in my keeper's hands and I was thinking about doing a, 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 a quick throw out and I literally said to you guys, I'm not going to throw it. I'm just going to hold on to it because the amount of times I throw the ball away from these positions. He's just done. My opponent's just done exactly that. My opponent rushed his goalkeeper throw for whatever reason. I don't know. <laughs> Tough game. I'm glad we came through that one. That, that guy was just all out attack, man. He just all out. Come back on defense and then build like fast build up. Literally come, drop back, fast build up. That guy was on. Yeah, 3-5-2 as well. What? He Wait, did he have Zidane? He didn't sub him. He started. I didn't even see Zidane. That's cr I didn't even see him in the team. Hey, I'll take that dub. That's nice. There we go. Moving on. That's, that's a pretty good team. Red Gabriel. Wow, he's got regular Adama on no chem style. Jeez. I don't... Man, these, these referees, man. That's a good play. That's a nice goal. Oh, that should have been a pen. I can feel myself pulling my defenders out all over. Yeah. Not surprised he's got loads of space here. I'm, my defense is all over the shop. That'd be a goal as well. Allison got a save, got a hand to it, but. I'm going into the 4 4 2. I'm going to have to. Oh, I'm a player. Ooh, that'd be a goal. Remind me, guys, after the game to look at the third goal. All right, there's one back. Man, Mole's shooting is crazy good. Yep, 3-2. We are right back in this game now. Let's go, Anaki, baby. All right, 3-3. Three, three. Keep his ball, please. <sighs> My lord, man. He's offside. No, he's not. He's been played onside by Lima there. That's so sad to concede. Oh, that's so sad to concede. All right. We've got 15 minutes to go here. Come on. We're creating so many chances. We're definitely going to get another one or two. That's so sad to lose that. I mostly want to see his third goal. I mostly want to see that third goal. There was just something about that goal that just didn't, didn't seem right. You have to. Oh, you you do have to do. it. Yeah, I, I know why he fouled. Oh my god, eleven saves for his Allison. Oh, eleven saves. Some of them were for corners. Look at where my shots are from. Honestly, the the chances that Lacazette missed in that first half cost us that game. I had one shot on the edge of the box and fifteen shots from inside the box. Fifteen. Thanks for the stars, pal. Much appreciated, bro. Jesus Christ. Look at that team, man. Outrageous team. Oh, my God. He's going to get fouled for that. <laughs> oh, my days. This game. Lovely goal, that. Thank God Mole is Mole, man. He might not be the fastest, but he is putting away chances that Lacazette is just missing. Well, this man will get most of the plaudits for his 
Let's go. Let's go, Boyan. Back in the game. That's my ball. Oh, come on now. That could be a goal. Come on, Bojan. Let's go, dude. I might stay just aggressive on this guy, you know. There it is. There it is. Let's go, Williams. All right, now we can drop off the uh, all-out attack. Stop doing what you're doing, man. This guy's running away from you when you're on the ball, like in your own half, 20, 20 yards away from his nearest player. God damn it, man. Go long. I don't know how he's managed to put that in the back of the net, but let's go. There it is. Oh my days. That'll be full time. Man, three games in a row where they've been played at 100 miles per hour. Honestly, crazy. I want to see if that, that last goal that I scored took a deflection or if he actually just banged it in. I, I just shot because I panicked. And, he, and he, he just flew it in like crazy. Look, look at it again, man. Oh, my days. Just crazy. I'm having so many chances and just struggling to get the goals. Your net player have killed the best thing about the game tonight. Furious yep. ISNT, the word. I agree with you, mate. Purposely I... destroying league SBCs have left me in limbo about playing the game. That's so, that's so unlucky for him, man. That's so jammy on my behalf. That deflection was crazy. This goal with Anaki Williams. Oh, no, this was his goal. Yeah, look. Wait, no, he gets his one. Yeah, it, was, it came from silly passing for me, that. This goal with Anaki Williams for me is real nice. Waited for the run. We moved his keeper, started sending him backwards. We hit that finesse shot there. That was a nice, uh, nice finish, that. Um, but anyway, we, man, long way to go, yeah. Pretty uh, pretty interesting squad. Tellez off Kem. If he just went for the Premier League version, he'd get uh, Kem on Alan St. Maximin and Kem on Tellez. It's just a big problem. And I've conceded first again. My God. Oh, like a baby. Oh, like a bang. Let's go. All right, two one. Oh, rip. Stop switching into your defenders. Good save. Just kidding. Just kidding. Yep, just kidding. Oh, my days. Oh Alright, 3-3, three, three, come on. Every game today has been a goal fest. It's been embarrassing for me. Defensively, I've been shocking. It should be a goal. Yeah, that's a goal. There we go, 4-3. Long again with the goal. Let's go, Dembele. He, slow it down a little bit, man. And now all of a sudden we're picking this guy apart. That's outrageous. How on earth does a keeper dive past the ball there? Let's go long. What a goal that is. That'd be a goal. He gets this cross right, which he should. Man, I've, I've even tried to stand there. I've, I've tried to stand in the way of that. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, he quit. Fair enough. There we go. I was going to make a sub for the last few minutes, but he quit. 
What a dumb game, man. What are these games? What are these games? L look again. All it is is my defending is horrendous. I've Even the game that I lost, I've dominated every game by chances and possession. Even the game that I lost. All of them, everyone. All right, guys. Welcome back. Uh, in between last and the gameplay and now here. Uh, I've done a few more. I, I haven't done any more of the uh, Sudamericana yet. The silver sud players are just too expensive. I don't think it's worth it. I'm going to have to do some number crunching and figure out whether there's any genuine value in completing those, just typically speaking. Um, in terms of champs, as I say, we're 8-2. and two. Crazy games, man. Just crazy games. In terms of division rivals, we've got 15,020 points now. Um, and I can't get any more points because of the way the uh, system works. It's at 14,500. So I have to hope between now and Wednesday, it doesn't go up by more than 500 points. Otherwise, we actually might lose out on rank one rewards in terms of squad battles i think i got like 1500 points last week that's all i played for uh rewards and so i believe it's gonna be probably bronze two a gold pack maybe bronze one maybe two gold packs but don't think it's gonna be much uh, so before we get into some more gameplay we've got a few packs from the uh the libsud grind a prime election players pack a mega pack and a premium gold players pack Hopefully, we can hit something nice out of those. Out of our two pre-order packs, though, a rare gold pack. We get balls. Let's go. Come on. Be something good. Ah, oh, it's Carlos Vera. Never mind. It's an 83 rated. It does, you know, it's bad. <laughs> um, send it forward to Cam, though. It's all right, I suppose. Not a lot else going on there. 83s right now are just so dirt cheap. It's not even funny. Um, another rare gold pack here. Come on, EA. Bless us. Hook us up, baby. Don't hook us down. No walkout. Boards. Let's go. Come on. Something nice. Dutch. Centre mid. Hey, it's De Jong. Let's go. He's, he's probably only about 10k these days, isn't he? I was hoping for Wijnaldum, but I'll take the 85 De Jong. That's all right. Woo. He's like 35k or so. 30, yeah, that's all right. I don't mind that a lot. That's all right, that is. That's all right. That is some nice pre-order rewards. Let's let's go. Let's go. Um, and then we've got a Prime Electron Players Pack. This is from... These are untradeable now. Um, so hopefully we can get something good out of these. No walkout. No boards. No blue either. I will take more Libsud cards out of these, man. Just give me as many as you want. Oh, he's actually really good for our Silver Stars team. That's very... Oh, another Emery Chan. A Fabian. Duplicate untradeable. A Chan. Duplicate untradeable. Tesk Fabregas, duplicate tradable. And uh, Knighton, duplicate tradable. Very nice. So 282s out the window there. Um, and then a premium gold players pack. Come on here. Come on here. Hook us up, baby. Don't hook us down. Hook us up, baby. Don't hook us down. It's not bored. It's not blue either. And uh, a mega pack. And then who knows what we'll have for the rest of today's video. Maybe a couple more games. I might go and grind properly, finish off the league SBC, just to complete it, just to say that I have. Um, I am super, super sad with EA that they have decided to make them as bad as they have. It's, it's, just, it's, it's just sad, isn't it? It's just real sad. Um, and then one mega pack, guys, here. If we get something good out of this mega pack, I'll open the other mega pack in the store. Because it'll be worth it. No walkout, no boards. Could be boards. We get blue in this, so one more in the bank for the uh, Libertadores. It's a right back as well, Montiel. He's a good one to get. He's, uh, he's a good one indeed. And we also get Boateng, Nacho. Oh, the French did Dan. Um, some contracts and such. Shadow and a couple of engines. You don't mind that. Send it forward to Cam Card as well. It's, it's all right. Um, Azari, tradable. Very nice indeed. Willian Jose, untradable. Aguilar, tradable. Very nice indeed. Uh, Ricuate, untradable. And then these guys can go. Um, and then we'll just uh, leave those things there. I... I just, I don't, I don't think I got much out of uh, squad battles rewards, guys. Uh, but we'll just double check. So I, I know I got something. I literally think it's one five k pack. Yeah, we got one five, one gold pack. But as you guys all very well know, it doesn't take much to get mad lucky in this game. All right, all it takes is a little bit of luck. A five k pack. Why not? That's why, because you don't even get a rare gold player out of it. Okay, that's fine. No, that's fine. This is what, it's, that's what you get for playing just one game. You know? Ooh, a thousand coins. See? That, that's all right. You take that, don't you? You take that. 
Um, and uh, yeah, we will be right back. Everyone's team is insane. Everyone's. That's outrageous. That is outrageous. Have you seen that? I've got Joe Gomez right there. I mean, right there. And he's somehow managed to run it through his legs. That could be a goal there. Oh, my days. Oh, my days. What is happening? Come on, Laka. All right, there's one back. Oh, Son. He's on as well. I can't believe that. <laughs> Let's go, buddy. All right, 3-2. That's on his left foot, that one as well. What a pen that is. Back in the game. 3-3. Three, three. Come on. Go on. Go on. Oh, he's baited me. No, he hasn't baited me. He's double, he's double bluffed. He's double bluffed. He pulled the keeper, dropped him back in, and then pulled him a little bit again. And we get the ball over the keeper's head. And it's 4-3. Oh. That's wide. Hey, the Johnny, thanks for sending your views over to the stream, man. I appreciate it, bro. There we go. I have the game over. Taking us so long again. So, it is honestly Lacazette that's the problem. There's another one. Hey, GG's, that's another win. That puts us on nine. My word, man. That guy actually played Jean-Felix at centre mid the whole game. <laughs> Once again, just control. I mean, I'm controlling games and I'm dominating and I'm scoring out, outscoring players and it's fun and all. But it's just, I seem to concede so many <laughs> goals, man. Um, but it, it's not working. This guy's got a Dharma Traore right back off chem. What am I seeing? What am I seeing? What? It's actually quite genius because he's strong and he's fast. and That's all you need in this game. There we go. There we go. 1 0. Come on. Come on, Laka. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Let's go. Let, 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 let's go. Hey, he's quit. He's quit. He's gone. This guy wanted out. This guy wanted out. That is us up to 10 wins. That is us up to 10 wins. Oh, that's a nice squad. But see, a, t a team like this, this I, don't, I don't know how much Werner is. Uh, Son's like 200k or less. This team's like half a million coins max, which is wild because it's very good. Genuinely horrendous pass. <sighs> and I concede first again from dumb passing, just rushing the play again. Oh, Lacazette's way. Let's go. Let's go, Laka. Moved his keeper there as well. Come on, Let's go, baby. What a finish that is. One more lay. Bang. Let's go. Laka. Let's go. Yeah, it's game over. We'll see you later, pal. GG's. And and then, yeah, we're going to struggle against teams like this. I mean, he's got Rafinha in there. He is definitely taking Rafinha out. He doesn't even have a chem style on him. And the rest of his team is unbelievably meta. He'll score one of these eventually, man. Oh, Sissoko, stop that.
And there it is. Nice finish as well. Come on, Laka. Let's go. Lucky to get the deflection there, but I'll take it. Let's go, man. Now, Laka gets a lot of those lucky bounces. Let's go, man. Lacazette gets a lot of those, like, bounces that just keep, like, he has what we call sticky leg. Is that it? Let's go, man. Nice goal, that is. Yeah, I think this guy's out. Yeah, he's gone. Happy days. Very nice stuff, that. He had a sick team as well, man. He had a really nice team. All right, guys. Welcome back to the road to glory. Um, I thought today we'd end off. I've got a few um, UCL packs, only three of them. Um, but I thought today we'd end off with a little review um, of the squad. What I did like, what I didn't like, who I did like and who I didn't like. And um, basically, I think... I finished 14 and 4, I think, with this team, which I'm really happy with, especially given the fact that we were 3 and 1 going into Sunday night and uh, we were just banging out game after game after game. And uh, what I really enjoyed was just playing with these players that I never normally play with. So I think every week we're just going to take a handful of the objective cards that we've picked up and haven't really played with and uh, build a squad around them. And uh, I think for this week coming, I think we're going to put Bellarabi and Mukieli in. We haven't used Mukieli at all yet. And Bellarabi, although we've used him for 25 games, I haven't started him. And he's very good. He's very fun to use. Um, so in terms of this team, guys, uh, j just to put something to bed as well that I saw in one of the comments about... Uh, it just kept getting thumbs up and this guy's just going out of his way to, to be a pain. Obviously, I've complained a lot about drop back, one depth, fast build up, that kind of uh, tactic... Even so, you're entitled to play how you want. Don't let me, you know, dis dictate how you play or whatever. And you can see here I have a drop back tactic. I literally never use this tactic. It is, uh, I basically, I had three tactics. Ignore attacking for a second, even though that's the one we use this weekend. I had my normal tactic, which is ultra defensive, which is very balanced across the board. Um, we then had a holy, mo holy moly, I'm hanging on. I need something. Um, you know, I need to just find a way to protect this lead, this guy's real good, there's not much time left, kind of drop back tactic, which I have honestly, I can hand on heart say, never switched into. And then we have a gung-ho, all-out attack, constant pressure, fast build-up, high-depth tactic that I switch into actually quite regularly. And in the gameplay that you've just seen, I switched into this a whole bunch. Um, but the formation, the tactic that we use this week is uh, this one right here. So full depth, pressure... Press after possession loss, and then again, fairly balanced here. Um, we set up like this Lacazette and Son up front, Dembele, Boyan, Moulet, and uh, sorry, Mole and uh, Sissoko in the midfield, Walker, Gomez, Long, and Lima in the back line with Allison in goal. And uh, you can see there we played fa you know, fairly basic stuff. Um, so, in terms of the team itself, guys, we'll start at the back. Allison, much like any goalkeeper in the game this year, is just he, he's just. He's great when he wants to be. He's terrible when he wants to be. You know, goalkeepers are just so weird this year. Uh, Kyle Walker, I can hands down say, is absolutely phenomenal. At right back, he's phenomenal. If we ever build into a Premier League squad or set up again, even at centre back, he'll be phenomenal. In fact, this week, if we put Mookie Elliott right back, we could play Gomez, Allison, and Walker at uh, centre back and, and have that kind of uh, set up for us because he is brilliant. Six foot, high, high work rates. Insane defending, brilliant physicals, obviously 99 pace, very nice dribbling. He's just absolutely amazing. As we always already knew, Joe Gomez is absolutely brilliant as well. That's why we've got 182 games on him in qu like quantified games anyway. Uh, and then we've got Long. Now look at the man. He's got 39 games and seven goals. He is spectacular. He's only on eight chemistry. Um... But even on 8 chemistry, 88 sprint speed, 86 acceleration, 
top tier defending, top tier physical, very nice passing for a centre back, extremely nice dribbling for a centre back. This guy is just genuinely brilliant. Um, six foot one, medium high work rates. And the reason why he scores so much from corners is because he has 95 jumping and uh, 92 heading accuracy with the shadow. I don't think you'll find, yeah, look at Gomez, 76 jumping and 74 heading accuracy. I think the jumping and heading from long makes him better than almost anyone in that spot. And then Lima as well, guys. I, I gave him the powerhouse. I might change his chem style to an anchor. Um, not because of any other reason than I just want that extra pace. But once again, this guy is brilliant. High, high work rates, much like Carl Walker. Um, very, very nice physicals. Very good defending. Uh, you know, his passing is a bit weak. And then dribbling is top tier. So I love this card a lot. This, this back line in general, in spite of the fact I conceded a lot of goals, which we'll get to half of the problems for that in a second, well, other than the fact that I'm just bad defensively. Um, this back line is sensational. So in at CDM, we have Sissoko. I, last year, I was anti-Sissoko. The year before, I was anti-Sissoko. This year, I was like, let me try him out. And I can now say, hands down, without any shadow of a doubt, after playing a four, like you know weekend league with him up to uh, 14 wins, the hype around Sissoko is not real. He's terrible. Um, three star, three star, obviously on him. His passing isn't that great. Uh, he's not that fast, even with the shadow chem star, 80 acceleration, 95, 94 sprint speed. I don't know what it is about him. He, like, is, is it his dribbling? Is it his passing? Is it a combination of the both? Um, he's just not the greatest defensive player in the world. And I struggled a lot with him. Um, you know, he just, he didn't get involved in the play. I didn't find that he was breaking. He isn't that Vieira or Hullet-esque kind of player that I was looking for that would just completely break down my opponents. He was just all over the place. I didn't like him at all. So don't, like, I don't know. I know some people love him. I know pro players over the last couple of years had him in teams, like, even fairly late on in the game uh, because he has what, what, what worked then. I think this year just doesn't work for me. I didn't like Sissoko at all. Uh, in terms of the two centre mids, I love them both. Molay, brilliant fun with him, man. 40 games, 19 goals, 14 assists for him. He is sensational. He, like, th there is one problem with this card. Uh, and the only problem is, is he doesn't really work as a centre midfielder. He needs to play as a cam. I played some games at striker with him, some games at centre mid, and some games at left mid with him. And he actually would work as an outside midfielder if you put a catalyst on him. He would be quite good. And we might try that for him this week coming um, because he's got obviously really good dribbling. Uh, good pace already and good passing. So a catalyst would take him to 96 acceleration, 93 sprint, 90, yeah, 93 sprint speed. Um, I love this card a lot. I just don't think it worked in the 4-1-2-2 and two formation for me personally. And similarly with Bojan, uh, first of all, he is the worst of the three uh, MLS players, in my personal opinion, in terms of usability. He doesn't have full chem. Uh, but once again, one of the problems here, medium-low work rates, you can you can notice it real bad. He just does not go, go forward unless you manually push him forwards. Um, he, other than that, he is very good. He scored a lot of goals for us as well. 10 goals and 14 assists in 39 games. It's not like he's doing nothing. It's just that in the team that we played, and I think maybe the way that I play, I need two defensive minor midfielders and then four attacking players. You know, So I need four defenders, two defensive midfielders and four attacking midfielders, four attackers, so to speak. Um, and the problem with Bojan it, for the way that I play is that you can't really play him out on the wing. I don't use a cam, so I can't really have him in that role. He would be incredible as a centre cam. Great stamina, brilliant dribbling, great shooting, great passing, good pace. I like this card a lot. He just didn't work for me personally. Uh, maybe it's his strength and aggression as well and his work rates and such. Um, but yeah, I, I think of the midfield, I did like Sissoko was hands down the worst. Then Bojan, then Mole was uh, real nice. We ended up taking out Bale and putting in Dembele at the right wing spot for the last sort of like five or eight games because Bale is terrible, man. I mean, he's, he's just terrible. I can't explain why. I don't know. Maybe it's his stamina. Maybe it's his dribbling reactions, perhaps. He's just terrible. Maybe it's his passing, like his short pass and long pass is actually bad. I just didn't enjoy him at all, uh, which is strange because early days of the game, he was one of my favorite players and I thought he was going to be someone that we, we were able to like utilize throughout the whole year. He's just not. I didn't like him at all. So put Dembele back in. Dembele is brilliant. Hyung Min Son is the star man in the team, as you could expect. 106 goal contributions from him in 93 games. He's played left mid, center mid, striker. He's played all over the shop for us in that 93 games as well. But he is just spectacular. I love him a lot. And then last but not least, we've got this man right here. Um, 
I like Lacazette's finishing a lot. He he does score almost every chance he has. And if you can see by his uh, goals and assist contribution, he's got 61 goal contributions in 47 games. That is no joke. That, that's a really nice return. The problem with Lacazette is his lack of pace is very, very noticeable when you come up against players who have teams that have defenders who have 90 plus pace. When you've got 91 acceleration and 88 sprint speed on this Lacazette, you've just got no chance of outpacing like Joe Gomez is and Rafael Varane's and players like that. You've got no chance. So although I love Lacazette, uh, you know, I'm a big fan of him in real life. I love him in the game. He finishes everything in the game. We scored some nice goals and had some good fun with him. I, he, he, he has to play up alongside an extremely fast player. And even Son isn't that for me. 91 acceleration, 94 sprint speed. You need to play Lacazette alongside a 99 pace player um, because uh, he's just not fast enough. So he was good. Altogether, guys, I, I think the team in general was nice. I didn't like the formation at all. 4 one 2 2 narrow was just not the one for me. Uh, I'm going to switch back to the 4 4 2 for next weekend. Uh, I just much, much prefer the balance of the team. Um, and uh, I don't know what we're going to do for the team, but the beautiful thing is, even if we take out Boyan here, we still get 8 chem and 10 chem on uh, the left back, centre back. So we can do. Pretty much whatever we want, um, we can have those guys in there. We could play Mukieli, and we'll try and figure out what else is going on. Uh, so on the account for objectives, I have all the objective players now. I have that Kunde card as well. Uh, we need to do a few little bits here and there. Um, but other than those few little bits, I mean, if you look at the objectives, I've not got a lot left. Obviously, milestones we've done as much as we can already as well. Um, so yeah, that's where we're at. So tomorrow, guys, we'll we'll put together a new squad. To end with for today, we've got three 81 plus UCL rare player packs. Can we finally get something of uh, any note? We don't get a walkout. If you don't get a walkout from one of these, you know it's bad. Well, unless you manage to get like a Furlan Mendy. We get a Renan Lodi there, first of all. It looks like 4K. That's all right, I suppose. Um, because the, the walkout's 84 plus on these ones. So, yeah, if you don't get a walkout, you know you've got an 83 or lower. You can't even have like an 84 or an 85. We don't get a walkout from the second one and so here we go the end we get kiepa the end of today's video with one more 81 plus pack if you did enjoy it be sure to leave a like rating comment and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already no walkout yet again um we are we are seemingly oh good lord so we've got an 81 an 81 and an 82 that is bad guys uh, so that is going to be the end of the video if you did enjoy it Thank you very much for watching. Be sure to leave a like, rating, comment, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. For now, I'm out. Peace.